Krabi is one of the most popular tourist destinations in Thailand, blessed with white sandy beaches, stunning islands, and awesome sea cliffs. In today's video, we're going to explore Krabi and the top 10 things to do in Krabi, Thailand. Let's get started! Krabi's main beach town on land is Ao Nang. It also has the most lively nightlife scene of any place on the mainland. Even though there aren't as many bright lights, loud music, and wild parties as in nearby Phuket, Ao Nang is still a lively and fun place to spend the night. There are many bars, and most of them have a laid-back, casual atmosphere. There are simple beachside shacks, dive bars, sports bars, and places with live music all over the area. There are also some fancier bars with great views and tasty drinks. Soy RCA is where people go to have fun, while Centerpoint provides live music and bands. Visiting the Tiger Cave Temple is one of the best things to do in Krabi. The Tiger Cave Temple, also known as Wat Tham Sya in Thai, is one of the most sacred Buddhist temples in Thailand. The Tiger Cave Temple is known for the tiger paw prints in the cave, the tall Buddha statues, and of course, the exhausting and strenuous hike up the Tiger Cave Temple mountain. But it's absolutely worth climbing the 1,237 steps until you reach the summit on top of a 600-meter high cliff to get a breathtaking view of Krabi. Rock climbing in Krabi is for the more adventurous traveler. The impressive and beautiful limestone cliffs are a perfect setup for this thrilling activity, with permanent hooks placed into rock through ropes that make it safe even if you're a beginner. The best beach to go rock climbing in Krabi is Tanzai Beach, located on the Rayleigh Peninsula. The 600-meter high long beach is stuck between two limestone cliffs, making it the perfect playground for rock climbers. Phra Nang Beach is Krabi's most popular beach, and you may enjoy a variety of water sports and activities like swimming and snorkeling, as well as kayaking, climbing, and trekking to the famed Rayleigh viewpoint. An important fertility shrine may be found in a cave on the seashore known as Phra Nang, or Princess Cave. Nam Tok Ron are nature's own hot tub jacuzzis located 70 kilometers from town and near the Khao Phra Bang Kram Nature Reserve. This site, hidden among the dense jungle, has naturally hollowed out bathtubs made of smooth stone. These hot spring tubs are among the most popular Krabi tourist attractions, with perpetually flowing fresh spring water at a comfortable 35 to 42 degrees Celsius. The water contains minerals that are natural healers and beneficial to your health. One of the most relaxing things to do in Krabi is to soak in the hot springs. It relieves all of your body's fatigue and prepares you for the next leg of your journey. After bathing in the natural tub, cool off in the river that runs alongside it. If it's beautiful, it won't be easily obtained, and its allure will be less valued. The Khao Nyon Nak viewpoint is popular among hikers and outdoor enthusiasts visiting Krabi Town, because of the adventurous and exciting trails that lead to the location. The name of the point translates to Dragon Crest Mountain, and exploring it is one of the best free things to do in Krabi. The trail is approximately 4 kilometers long and includes a stream, two viewpoints, a waterfall, the summit, and plenty of picturesque scenery along the way, as seen in Hollywood films such as King Kong and Avatar. The view from the summit is breathtaking, and it's a welcome treat for all photographers. Tong Dao Forest Natural Park is among Krabi's most impressive natural attractions. It's extremely popular among photography and nature aficionados. The ancient lowland forest contains the Emerald Pool, a natural swimming lagoon, as well as beautiful waterfalls and hot springs. Observe a variety of birds, lizards, small mammals, and insects while hiking along the nature route. Once assumed to be extinct, the Gurney's Pitta Bird is a rare sight. The breathtaking Four Island Tour is definitely one of the top things to do in Krabi and covers Koh Gai, Koh Tup, Koh Mao, and Koh Poda. This fun experience usually provides you with a short amount of time to enjoy each island as well as check out Pranang Cave aboard a speedboat. Koh Gai is a chicken-shaped island, hence the name Gai, which means chicken, and is linked to Koh Tup with a sandbar. The third island, Koh Mao, is a rocky spot with cliffs jutting out of the sea and lush green foliage on top. Finally, Koh Poda, usually the last stop, is a large island with coconut plantations. 
This market or pedestrian walkway is not to be missed when visiting Krabi. The Krabi Night Market, known as Krabi Town Walking Street in Thai, is one of the must-do activities in Krabi. Experiencing the Krabi Night Market will provide a peak of Southern Thai culture and tantalize your taste buds. The right components for a night out in Krabi are local artists and an abundance of fantastic food stalls. However, you must be in Krabi Town during the weekend as the market is only open from Friday evening at 4 p.m. to Sunday evening at 10 p.m. According to reports, there are more than 70 stalls on the Krabi market. Thus, there are sufficient options for food, beverages, and snacks. This experience is all about the bright ambiance and delectable taste of native Thai cuisine you'll gain a genuine understanding of Thailand through interacting with the locals. The good news is that in Krabi, there are a number of elephant sanctuaries. Elephants in need now have a new home and a chance at a better life thanks to this sanctuary. If you've ever wanted to see elephants in their natural habitat, here is the place. You can participate in the feeding and bathing of the elephants, as well as enjoy a walk with them. Honestly, you could spend your entire trip in Krabi and not be bored for a single second. You've got beaches, islands, caves, waterfalls, temples, hot springs, mountains, the list goes on and on. Few destinations offer as much as Krabi, so stay a while and experience a bit of everything. That wraps up the video. I hope you enjoyed it, and if you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to our channel and don't forget to press the bell icon to stay notified about our uploads. Until next time.